What's going on guys? Welcome back into another video and today, today it's Disney Plus Day. Welcome, hello, hi, how you doing? Welcome. Uh, it's Disney Plus Day, so there was a bunch of announcements. You know, we got a Kenobi teaser kind of sizzle reel and a bunch of Marvel stuff was announced for Disney Plus. So before we get into that, first off, I want to say hello. If you are new, if this is your first time watching the channel, thank you so much for coming and taking the time. Please subscribe if you have not already. We do Marvel stuff all year long. I do trailer reactions, movie reviews, rankings. I just released my MCU ranking this past week. Go check it out if you've not already with Eternals. Um, but basically what we're going to do today is that Marvel had a presentation come out on Disney Plus. It was 14 minutes long, um, just announcing some new stuff. We got some footage of Moon Knight and, and other, other things like that. Unfortunately, we can't, like, like, I can't show you any of the footage because it's just not out. Um... So, yeah, I, like, I can't show you any of the footage because it was just on Disney Plus. It's not out on Twitter. It's, it wasn't revealed anywhere else. But we're still going to talk about them. I've got, I'm going to take the photos and the screen grabs that off of Twitter and show you guys what we're working with. But it's exciting. I mean, there wasn't anything so dramatically groundbreaking that was that was like blowing my mind. But we, like I said, did get first-time looks at some of these shows. So... I retweeted a lot of the stuff, so I'm just going to kind of go through my Twitter and go through my page and follow me at Jack Lauder, right? It'll be down below in the description. I'm always retweeting and, and, and things like that on Marvel content. Um, but let's get into it. So first off, we had Ironheart. Uh, we, got it, we got a logo. It still has the coming soon status. We don't have a timetable for that yet. Um, the character is going to be in Black Panther 2. I forget what her name is. Um, but, but Ironheart is going to be in Black Panther 2, so I think we could expect to see that come out early to mid 2023 I, I would say is the timetable for Ironheart kind of all the information we have on it so far um this is the biggest I think this is the biggest announcement of all of them is Agatha House of Harkness House of Harkness uh Disney Plus series coming um around Agatha and all of that so it's a spinoff of WandaVision. I know y'all love WandaVision so much, and I know that Agatha was my favorite character. I think everyone can agree that that Agatha was was awesome. Um, so confirmed, and I we I know that um that 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 had already been discussed and talked about that that Agatha was going to have more to do in the MCU. Um, but but now we have confirmed coming soon status on Disney Plus Agatha House of Harkness um, Disney Plus show. I'm excited. Love Agatha Harkness. I think she's a great character. I think that a lot can be done here. I, I, I like to have more of the mystic kind of realm of the MCU, not just Doctor Strange and and Wanda. We're really going to open up, you know, the mystic realm of of the MCU, and I think that'll be very interesting. And I, it obviously, I'm assuming will be after uh, Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness because we're going to see what's up with Wanda and Doctor Strange in that show. So we'll see. I'm interested. Um, there's a lot of potential here. I think it'll be absolutely fantastic. Secret Invasion got a new logo. And I will be popping up the logos here here somewhere throughout the, the video. Secret Invasion got a new logo. It is uh, scroll-themed because we're going to be dealing with the scrolls in Secret Invasion. Um, coming soon status, I'm assuming next year, hopefully, maybe the year after that. And obviously, very exciting, Samuel L. Jackson uh, Amelia Clark, um, Ben Mendelsohn, you know, are all going to be back. Uh, and Monica Rambeau, I believe, is in this as well, um, which is going to be great. And also, we got our first look at Samuel L. Jackson in Secret Invasion. I'm going to pop that up on the screen right over here. O older, beaten down Nick Fury. I'm interested. I, I am very interested to see what's going on. Doesn't have the eye patch anymore. I mean, that's it's very interesting. I I'm very interested to see what this is what this show is because i think it could it could have a lot of potential to change the mcu as we know it um all right let's talk about moon knight um actually i'm gonna get to moon knight last the next one is she hulk we got some actual footage of she hulk and it's got mark ruffalo in it as hulk two mark ruffalos we have uh professor hulk and regular uh regular um bruce banner which at first was kind of shocking to me, but then I remember in the post credit scene of Shang-Chi, which is now out on Disney+, Plus. go watch it if you have not already. In the post credit scene of Shang-Chi, Mark Ruffalo is in it, and he is as regular Bruce Banner. He is not as Professor Hulk. So, 
we're going to be going back and forth between Professor Hulk and regular Bruce Banner, and it looks cool. There's a lot of potential here for a lot of characters to show up, Daredevil. I don't, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, there's a lot of potential. I'm very interested in this show. We just haven't seen a lot yet, so good first look. I'm excited. I think there's a lot of potential. I think it's going to look really, really good. Miss Marvel. Um, we got footage for as well. Very excited for this, but it got delayed a year. Originally, from what I thought. I don't know how the financial cal calendar works, but it said quarter four of 2022, and I assumed that was just winter. Uh, you know, like around the time when Hawkeye is going to be coming out this year. But... Then it says coming summer of 2022. So we're actually going to get this a lot sooner than I thought we were. Not delayed an entire year. Delayed six, seven months. So we got some footage. It looks great. I'm very excited to see Kamala Khan and all of that. I think um, with it being with the Marvels, with Monica and 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 uh, and Carol, um, I'm very excited to see how that, that goes. I, I think that it's going to be very interesting. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, Miss Marvel coming out in the summer uh what else do we have uh we got a an extended like first scene of hawkeye in this in this um disney plus kind of day um it looks awesome i mean this is it's going to be great i am very very excited for this series i think Haley steinfeld looks great jeremy renner looks great looked action-packed and thrilling I, I am incredibly excited. It's less than two weeks away, I think. I don't know off the top of my head, but it's going to be great. I'm really looking forward to it because I feel like I love Hawkeye, and I think Hawkeye has been very underrepresented in the MCU. He deserves the credit. Um, it's going to be fun. I, I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's going to be an absolute blast. Um, a few other things, uh, some animated stuff. Uh, X-Men 97 is getting more episodes. I've never seen it. I should probably go check it out. Uh, there's an animated Spider-Man show that's coming out, Spider-Man Freshman Year, which I think will be cool. Uh, I Am Groot got a new logo. Um, holiday special for Guardians of the Galaxy is coming out. Um, confirmed, what if Season 2 is going to be coming? Um, also confirmed, Loki Season 2, as we already knew. Um, but let's talk about Moon Knight. Uh, we... It looks incredible. I think Oscar Isaac looks fantastic. We got our first footage, um, which I wish we could react to and show, but we can't because it's just on Disney+. Plus. Um, we got our first set of footage. Um, oh, no. We got it. Wait. We got it. It's here. Right here. Bam, 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 bam. Um, okay. Uh, let's react to it. I think we're, we're going to... I'm going to take a hard right turn right now, and we're uh, going to... Actually, you know what? No, we're not. I'm going to react to it in another video that's going to come out first. So go over and watch that video. Moon Knight looks fantastic. I think there is a lot here that can be really, really good. Um, Oscar Isaac, I love. I'm very excited to see. Um, and the potential for Moon Knight is huge. But I'm going to do a full video on that. So go check out that video first. But I want to thank you all so much for watching. That's pretty much it. That Again, like, it wasn't a ground-shattering day. We did get some, some footage, which I'm really excited about. But it wasn't ground-shattering. That's okay. Because I think people needed to realize that this was just the stuff coming out on Disney+. Plus. It wasn't going to be for the movies or anything like that. So I'm, I'm content. I think it was great. It's better than Star Wars, which we just got like a sizzle reel for Kenobi. Um, it's going to be great. Let me know down below in the comments, what are you most excited for? What was your favorite uh, reveal of the day? I think a lot of people are going to say Ag Agatha. I think that, that was really big. Um, but this is a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I want you all to have a great rest of your day. We'll see you in the next video.